this artillery unit, okay, firing at this square, that's uh, print, uh, British units in square. So, there we go. We're in there close. All right, so that's 12. So, square is going to be 2 to 1. Square is considered like a col column. 62. Two to one, 62 is a hit. So, I guess that's the first hit that they take. Is their foot? So, don't believe they're gonna have to check morale. That is gonna be, uh, let's see. just an even increment, except for the King's Legion. So, um, okay, so I put this guy back. All right, and let's see here. Um, Those guys are in line. Okay, so this artillery unit. And this infantry unit right here. They only have one left. So their power power is reduced by half. So instead of a six, they have a three. Okay. Um, so that's going to add to that 18 right here. So that's 21. Uh, that's uh, two to one. Um, let's see. Uh, let's see. Let's see. He's a line, so that's nine. Uh, let's see, 21, that'd be three. So yeah, it's not enough. Okay, so two to one, and it goes up two because of canister to three to one. 52, okay, is one hit. All right, so that is a Uh, even and so they lost more than a half so that's minus six ain't the yeah. 13 so they passed okay um, they had three only three hits so they would get to fire at a strength of 12 uh, doesn't do any good to fire on the artillery, so they're going to fire on this infantry unit. So that'll be two to one. 25, I don't think that's enough to do a hit, even on two to one. Yeah, okay. So no hit there. I wasn't even looking at it, but too good was I? All right, so now um, I'm going to shift over here. Okay, so we 
have this unit. KGL. Okay. Firing at the unit and column. So KGL uh, in line times four. So 16. Okay. Um, it's 12, that's 2.5. 44 is a hit. So, French unit is going to take a hit. Okay, so they're going to be at three hits. Which means we've got to check morale. Before we do that, they're going to return fire, and their fire strength is a hey, seven. Okay, so and their morale is a thirty-one. Okay, so seven to nine. But I guess one thing I should be doing is when, okay, on assaults, actually those fires shouldn't take place until after the roll to, roll to close, roll to, roll to stand. Are, are made. So <clears throat> Where I have those um, where I have the uh, those assault markers, I have to hold off. So this here, let's go back to the two. And okay. So We we'll have to go to uh, here and here. And so what we have is we've got uh, Coldstream Guards. It's got just one uh, increment left. And then we have uh, the uh, 60th coming in. Uh, we'll provide the other three factors. So, all right, um, the guards, okay, Uh, well, they'll all be the same times five, so that'll be 20 against uh, column. It's two to, is uh, three to one, so 42. Okay, that's one hit. Okay.
right, now they're in line. These guys are in line. So they've got three increments. Well, they've got four because they just flipped it over, right? Yeah. Okay, so 18 plus the uh, infantry, which is four. Uh, it's times three. It's 12. So that's 30. 30 to nine. Three to one. But then they get to, uh, because it's canister, it's five to one. 52. Okay, that's two hits. So the first hit will take this top, the cold, cold stream guards out. They only had one left. So those guys are gone. Um, cold stream guards. All right, and then uh, one hit to the 60th foot. And since there's two hits there, even though they're split, I gotta check morale. So, and they've got a 10, so uh, they're not gonna fail. They're gonna hold in there no matter what. All right, so now we go, we'll go here. <clears throat> so we've got, let's see what we got here. Okay, so we're gonna have four here that's going to be 30 again. So we're going to have 30 against this stack here. So that's going to be three to one with uh, upshift to five to one due to the canister. And then we got a 63. Okay, five to one, 63 is two, two hits. So, this unit here, okay, is now down to uh, only one. But they had, uh, they did have, let's see, they got a 15. Okay, um, what are those guys? Scott's guards, okay. Okay. Okay, so that's times five, so that'll be 15 to six, two to one. 16 is a miss, no effect. All right, so they've got to check morale. They passed. Um, let's go back to here. Okay, he's getting shocked right there, so I have to hold off. Um, Well, I guess these guys can go ahead and fire. Uh, well, no, I, have, I really need to wait. If they pass their, if uh, if everything's passed, then they're going to fire. So we'll just move on down. To some of these that uh, don't have... Uh, a uh, assault. 
this artillery unit here really doesn't have anything to fire at um, because of these units here. Um, I mean, I guess they could fire at this artillery unit. Um, but of course, they've already been, uh, well, no, they haven't been fired on. But they've already fired. 15. They've got a range of 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That would put them at 10. They're not going to do any damage. All they could do is suppress them, and they've already fired, so. All right, uh, let's take a look at uh, what we got in here. So we've got shock, shock here. We've got shock here. This unit uh, can fire here. Um, let those two do their business. And uh, we'll have this unit fire now on this unit. And of course, this unit I should have flipped over because they're in line. That way I know they're in line. Okay. So, that's the 85th, 83rd foot. Right there. Okay. <clears throat> so, Four times four is 16. Uh, they're in line, so it's going to be 1.5 to 1. Over 62. That's going to be a hit. Okay. check morale but then they get to fire back so now we flip these so that's uh they're in line lion la, lion lin that's gonna be times three so that's 12 to 9 um that's only gonna be one to one 56 at one to one is a hit. So they both take a hit. Only difference is the French unit has to take a morale check. And the British unit doesn't. So they've got a 35. Thirty-five, so they pass barely. Okay. Um, we've got we've got here we've got shock, shock, shock. So and we've got shock here. By both of these to here. So this you know I have to fire here. Uh, that's just a 24th foot. Over here, 24th foot. So that's going to be 16 to uh, 6. So that's uh, two, uh, yeah, two, let's see, 16, no, yeah, 16, six. So yeah, that's gonna be 2.5 two to one, 63. They fire back. Uh, 
now they only got one left. They're gonna have a strength of three. So they're gonna be gone. But they get to fire back, so that would be um, three. That's one to one to three. Miss. Okay, so they are gone. So that's the second battalion of the 16th regiment. And let's see here. We do have some artillery here that I think might have some shots. Okay, let's start with this one here. So, one, two, three, four, one, two, I think he's too close. So, he could possibly fire over one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That would be at three. He's in column, so it'd be one to one to two. Fifty-six. They're actually firing right here. One to two. Nope. Okay, and then the ricochet. Okay. To here. Sixty-one. It's not enough. And then, so, okay, that was uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. Okay, that's as far as the record check can go. Okay, now this one, firing here would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, that would only be a strength of one, so no. Yeah, we don't have any there. And then if we look here at uh, this artillery unit here, that's uh, six, that's as far as I can shoot, so. Oh, we do have some over here with the The Spanish. So we've got this unit here. Okay. Fire on these cavalry units. Okay, in column. So Should be in line. So that's going to be a times one. So that's going to be a four. Uh, one to one point five. Not, almost. Not enough. Okay. Here's the first one here. Okay. So let's see what we got here. Um, Okay, they're in that hex. Let's put them out here beside each other here. Okay. Okay, so the British unit is charging. So, 
the French unit has to roll the sand. Okay, so. Okay, so they're the target of a British resolve. So that's, that's not a six. Okay, and the odds, okay, we look at the two numbers. The French have lost two, so they've got four. Uh, it's six to four. So that's just one to one. Okay. So they've got minus six. All right. And they've got a morale of 31. And they rolled a 62. So they, they stand. So now the British have to roll to close. So I guess first we should fire uh, the uh, defender should fire. So they were in column. So they have a seven. British are in line. So it's one one point one to one point five. Fifty one Okay, they didn't hit anything. So now, roll to close. Doesn't look like there's any modifiers. Okay. They have a 26. They rolled a 15, so they don't roll to close. So they just stop. So no shock there. Get back in there. Okay, so now we shift over to the next one. Let's see if anything happens with that one. So we actually have two here. Um,
Okay. If they're in square, I think they're just automatically would be rope. They're going to stand. Um, Yeah, they get a plus six. So, so that would even out because the the, the British are getting a, a put a not minus six on them. So it's going to be this against the square here. And the square they've got a thirty one. So sixty two, so they they passed. Now they get to fire. There's uh six of uh, six uh third it is two and when they're in square, French in square is times three, so that's six. So it'd be one to 1 1.5, 66. Of course, that's going to be a hit. So. They've taken a hit. Um, and they've got a 14. That means they're more likely going to pass. 46, so they pass. They're rolled to close. So now they get to fire. <clears throat> and uh, they're in line. So that's going to be 16. Squares of 6. So that's two and a half to one. Fifteen, that's not gonna that's not gonna be a hit. Okay, so now we uh can go to the uh melee. Alright, so the British are gonna lose or have a minus six to the to the die roll due to uh losing an incre increment to defensive fire. Okay, now they're assaulting a unit that's in square, so that's going to increase their melee by three seconds. They have a melee of 14, so we multiply that by three. That's 42. And then we divide it by, by two. Multiply by three, that's 42. Divide it by two, that's 21. So they're going to have 21, and the square is going to have 12. Okay, so 21 to 12, uh, it's not two to one. It's going to be uh, one to one, let's see, 1. 1.5 to one. And we have a minus six to the die roll. Roll to 44, we have to subtract 6, so that's going to be a 34. Uh, so that's a blank result. So that means we go to uh, Firefight. I'm, I'm going to give the British plus 6 to the die roll. All right, 61 becomes 66. And so that's going to be three losses, and they have to uh, disorder. So that makes sense. Uh, being in a being in a square. So let's pull back here. And so they're going to take three losses, disorder. Get 
rid of that. Uh, they would actually take four because they're moving out of the zone of influence. So, all right. So, let's see. Well, I guess they already had one right here. So they're going to be they're going to be wiped out. Okay. So, sixty third. Okay, the 3rd Battalion. Alright, so now we can do the other shock. Which is right here. So, this unit has already lost two. This unit has lost one. So, okay. So, the French are the defenders. He was in column. So that's not in his flank. It's actually in his, uh, still in his front. So, okay, they're gonna have a minus six to their roll to, to stand because it's a British Huzzah. So, 31, 26, so they don't stand. Okay, so they're not going to get to fire. And they're going to lose a step in their retreat. So they're going to have to uh, disorder. Okay. One. Oh, wait a minute. He was right. He should have been right here, right? Not, it wasn't the 94th, it's 27th here. This guy. Okay, so one, two, three, four. What am I doing with this guy? This guy didn't have three losses. That right? Maybe I don't have it right. Yeah. Yeah, it is this one. Okay. So, one, two, three, four. Disordered. And 
this guy. Actually come in there like that. All right, now let's move over here to this other shock. So, <clears throat> all right, so let's pull these guys out of here. Okay, we'll put this here. Pull these guys out. Okay. Put it right there. And then let's flip these guys over so we have an idea of what we got. Okay. Okay. So they're full strength. Okay. So these guys are the ones shocking. We'll turn it this way. All right. So the British have to uh, Check to stand first. Uh, they have to roll first. Check to stand. And uh, they've got a 23. And I don't think they're going to have any modifiers. Except for, they do have a modifier for um, due to the odds. Okay, so we've got 6 to 11. Um, that's not 2 to 1, though. So that's like almost 2 to 1. So, well, actually, it's 10. 6 to 10. So. All right, they have a 23, rolled a 22, so they don't stand. So, the French are going to get to fire on them, be 7 to uh, 9. 1 to 1.5, 32 is not anything. Uh, so they're going to take a loss and disorder. So they take a loss. And they disorder. So let's see here. Okay, back to hexes.
and the British, the uh, French now, will advance. So then I can go to there. Okay, so let's go to the next one. Okay. That's going to be right here. And that's a, what is that? That's a skirmisher. So, okay, skirmisher, I got to check that. So, let's see, skirmisher can retreat. Okay. Okay. So, they can retreat back to here. So, and then this unit can advance and shock again. So, this, this stack with McKenzie will have to roll the stand. Okay, so... Let's pull back and take a look at the uh, the units. So right here, we've got uh, McKenzie, okay. And then we've got the skirmisher, okay. And the 45th foot and the attackers are part of the uh, eighth division. So, okay, they have a uh, strength of five, strength of seven, plus the uh, half, doesn't really matter. So, that's still gonna be, it's, uh, well, it's gonna be one to, one to two. But for them, it'd be, uh, two to one, uh, but not quite. For them, it's still one to one. They don't get that up, up, rounding up. But they do have the leader with them, which is a plus, uh, which in this case would be a minus three, um, because you want to roll lower than your morale, so. 61, they passed. And then, of course, they get to fire and uh, the skirmishers uh, retreated, so they're not going to be able to fire. So it's just going to be the 45th foot, which can fire four. That'd be 16 against uh, <clears throat> a column. So 2.5 to 1.
Okay, so 20, 25. I think that's going to be a miss. Let's stick together for some reason. Yeah, 25, no effect. Okay, so now the French have to roll to uh, roll to close. And it's a one, one to two, so not, let's see, it'll be a plus six. Um, so no, no, which, why was it a plus six? No, it's, You gotta roll higher. Why is it a why is the being an odds assaulting the odds assaulting the target hex? Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so I don't know, something doesn't look right there. He passed. 52 is a pass. Okay, so they get to fire. And then we have the combat. So they have seven to nine. Okay, no effect. All right, so now let's uh, go with the combat. The melee. So... Nobody lost in increments. So it's five against seven. That's going to be one to 1.5. Um, Mackenzie gets to uh, subtract one. No. Yeah, subtract one from the die. No, he's on defense. So subtract three. Oh, a 66 becomes a 63. And that's going to be defenders going to lose two and have to disorder. But they're going to lose more than that. They're going to lose at least another one. So that's three. Um, and let's see. We got a 66. Uh, they almost had a leader casualty. Well, a natural 66 is going to be, should be a, a uh, leader casualty. So we got to roll for McKenzie. Okay. There it is. <laughs> A three, a leg wound. So seven, he'll be out seven hours. Seven hours. So Mackenzie is lost. So oh, it's uh, 940. So won't come back in until like 440. So we'll just say five o'clock. And uh, so these guys here 
uh, are going to be disordered, but they've lost McKenzie. Plus, they also have suffered three times or 50% of their, their, their uh, increments. So, all right, so they go back to Okay. This unit can advance. And we have to roll again. Uh, let's see what McKenzie is morale. Okay, three. So that'll subtract three. 23. Okay, they're going to route. Um, So, one, two, three, four, five, six. We'll flip them over. Like so. Okay, then we have uh, the next assault there. Okay which is this unit and this unit. So, okay, let's put them right here. Okay. I guess I'll, I'll put them right here. That's, out of the way of everybody. Uh, okay. What am I doing? I come on, uh, should be using their, <clears throat> what am I doing? I'm just using the, uh, I didn't do those right. I didn't, I didn't, uh, should have been using their me melee factor. It's not just their strength, but their melee factor. So, for example, these guys would have 27. He's got 14. Well, actually less. Um, this guy's got to be 12, 25 to, to like 12, 25 to 12, two to one. That's what that, that would be. Um, all right, so he's outnumbered. So rolling the stand. So it'd be minus three. He's got a morale of 22. Uh, Roll to 16. Okay, so he he doesn't uh, he doesn't stand. So he's going to disorder. He's going to lose at least one. Um, So here, he's already lost one, so he's going to lose, he's going to be, uh, have two losses now, but, let's see, I guess he could go one, two, one, two to there. 
And of course now, these two guys are advancing. To there. All right. Then we have this shock. I guess this, these guys are both shocking here. This guy's just, he's going to, uh, let's say he's going to escape back to here. Uh, well, he, he can escape, uh, up to eight, so, uh, well, if he goes eight, he's gonna just, uh, he's gonna route. So he would just go one, two, three, just behind that guy. But <clears throat> then these two guys are actually coming in together. Like so. And they're now route, uh, attacking this guy. Who is getting it in the flank. So. He's got a roll to close. I mean, a uh, roll to stand. Uh, he won't be able to fire. So, going to be minus six. The odds are, let's see what the odds are, 12, and uh, he's got seven. So, not quite two to one. Um, So it's just going to be the minus six for being in the flank. So he's got 22, 54. So he rolls to stand. Now they've got to roll to, to close. So we got 25 and 35. 56, so they both, they both, uh, <clears throat> close, which now they fire, firing into a line in uh, their flank is the same as firing into columns, so it's one to one. 36, I don't think that's going to be, uh, no, okay. So now we go to the assault. Okay. Okay, so assaulting a flank is double your attack value. So their attack value is 12 and 27. That's doubled. So it's going to be 50, 54 to 14. So almost four to one. Just, just shy of four to one. Okay, three to one, 53. Okay, there's gonna be uh, defender routes. So they're gonna take a loss. So they're in that, let's see, 
you know, they're in this hex. And these guys are in this hex. Okay. So they've got a route. Um, so they take a loss here. They can't move to there. They've got to move to here. So they take a loss there. So now they're at two losses. Okay. They move through these guys. Um, so that's uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, and flip them over. Okay. Now this guy here has to check morale because he had uh, he had that uh, routed unit uh, go right through him. So okay. There's a minus 12 to the die roll. He's <clears throat> plus he's disordered, so that's another minus three. So that's 15. Okay, 53, and he's at what, 20? 22? Okay, so 53. Okay, so that's six. There's 12. One, two, three. Okay, he barely, he barely maintained control there, so he's still disordered. Okay, so Lapice has been able to do what Ruffin failed at. And that's to uh, assault the British and force them back. So now, now is when you need your cavalry to come swooping in. But the French have sent their cavalry to attack the Spanish over by Talavera. But and they could also use if they had, uh, if uh, Sebastiani would uh, bring his core over, then they could exploit that. But let me pull back here. have to go over that later. I've got to uh, do the uh, reorganization step here um, first. So let's do that. I've got that. Uh... Okay, so we've got this cavalry unit here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 13, 14, 15. Okay, they're far enough away. So they are routed and they have a morale of 41. So 45 is not enough because they've got to subtract six for being routed so they don't recover. Um, this unit here needs to move further back. So one, two, three, four, five, 
uh, six. Okay, and uh, we'll go ahead and do the uh, do the uh, British and the Spanish here. Okay, so uh, this unit here. Okay. Okay, 23. All right, they rolled a 65, so they recover. Okay, this one here. 22. Okay, 54, they recover. Uh, these guys are too close. And what do we got underneath here? Six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. These guys are too close. One, two, three, four, five, six. They go to there. These guys are too close. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So they can go thirteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Probably they can't go that far. They're exhausted, so they can only go like, uh, maybe like here. Okay, uh, what do we got back here? All right, they're far enough back. Um, let's see what they're... Uh, 45 minus 6, 62. That would be 52, so they they recovered, which means I can start getting some of that back. Uh, talking about that, let me go back over here. Uh, so these guys didn't do anything, so they recover both of those, so they're totally fresh. Um, I'll take care of the French here later. Okay, so now let's look over here at, um, okay, so these guys didn't do anything. They can recover that. These guys didn't do anything, so they can recover back to tired. All right. Um, Okay, over here, okay, these guys all have to go uh, further away. So, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. And these guys can go three, six, three, six, three, six, three, six. <clears throat> and they can actually uh, try to recover now that they're in a, a dwelling. So, all right. So, okay. This unit here has to has to get further away. So they're going to move through these guys here. So one, two, three, four, five. Uh, stream for the cavalry. What is that? Plus two. Uh, let's see. He's he's still t exhausted, so he can only go uh, like three. So one, two, three. He can only go right there. Okay, now these guys here have to roll whether or not they get this, uh, what happens to them. Okay, 
So you have routed with good order. Okay, that's my, that's minus 12. The other one should have routed um, that I said because wherever that was at, I know where it was at. I'll fix it. If you have a uh, disorder uh, and routed unit runs through it, they both route. But, okay, so minus 12. Okay, they're going to route. Uh, or they're going to disorder. So. So, with that leader. They disorder and go under the olive groves there. Okay, so that's all of, all of them. And let's come over here where I had uh, this unit here was in disorder. And I had a routed unit run through them. So, They should have, they should have just routed, which would be six away. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then it would have went another six. One, two, three, four, uh, five, six to get away. Okay. Um, okay, so let's just work across here. Um, <clears throat> These guys will go to tired because they weren't fired on, but they did move. So we've got to, they can only get one of their exhaustions back. So they're still exhausted. Okay, this unit could actually, okay, they, the same thing happened because they, did they move? I wouldn't consider that really too much of a move. So they're just tired. Same thing here. These guys are just tired. Over here, we're just, just tired. All right. And then uh, back here. So this guy. He's lost half, so he's at six and uh, 32. He's in a dwelling or considered special structures. So that's a plus six, right? So he's just going to have a minus six and he got an 11. So no, he didn't, he didn't pass. He needed more than 11, he needed more than 32, 32 or more. Okay. And then here we've got, uh, we're going to have a plus four for this, uh, cavalry unit, 25, minus 6 plus 4 is going to be minus 2, 46 they pass, so they're not uh, routed any longer, they're still exhausted, okay, Now we have these other guys here. Um, we can remove these two. We 
got 41. Forty-one. Okay, he's got to keep going. He's got to go keep going eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, and then over here. Polish Lancers. All right, so first we have this one here. Minus six. Okay, it didn't pass. So, just leave it like that. Okay, so the next one here, same thing. He didn't pass. This one. 14. He didn't pass. This one. Forty-two. Okay, he's gonna pass. He's got to go eight more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Back to there. All right, so none of these guys passed. All right, then we uh, look up here. We've got uh, this guy here. Now they've lost more than half, so that's minus six, and minus three is minus nine. 33, they route. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Um, let's see here. Um, uh, we got a route here. Um, they can only route, let's see. Um, one, two, three, four away. Okay, which guy gets these? So he's fresh. And that is all of the 940 turn, which completes the nine o'clock hour, which means we'll be going over to the Napoleonic Battle Series. And the next video. And so here's a look of, at the battlefield. We've got uh, the tour has really punched a hole here in the Spanish line between the van and the third division. The second division has been pushed back into Talavera. And Cuesta has sent his reserve off to help the British when now he actually needs it back. 
Uh, same thing with uh, Manglano here. He sent them to uh, assist with the uh, French attack on the British left. So we got a lot of chaos happening. Now the French do have a lot of routed units. And I probably need to check some morale levels. Um, the British have lost, lost quite a few units, but most of them have been just uh, light infantry skirmishers. So the only thing the, the, the Spanish have lost is uh, one artillery battery so far. And let's see here. Like I said, it's kind of hard to really tell uh, what's what here because it, they kind of jumbled. But um, this is artillery here. Uh, let's see here. This, this is a light, 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 light. Um, that's a light unit, light unit, light unit. Okay, so, so far, uh, I see the British have lost two, two infantry battalions, uh, cavalry, Regiment, their cavalry leader, an aide de camp. Um, Mackenzie's been knocked out. They've uh, lost one battery. While the French over here have lost one battalion there, uh, two, three, four, five, six. They've lost six battalions. Three artillery batteries, but no leaders. So Ruffin has lost three battalions, Lapis two, Valette one. So that kind of gives an idea of what's been lost. But then, of course, we have quite a bit lost here on the uh, on the on the map still that hasn't been added. There's a lot of uh, hit high hit markers underneath these counters for the French, but of course the uh, the British have pushed through right here, but then they've got knocked back in here. So we we'll have to see what happens here uh, in this fight right here, and of course you have these heavy cavalry unit there that uh, could pounce, but he doesn't have a leader. He'd have to, of course, Wellington has that aide-de-camp he could send here uh, that could possibly uh, do some, some damage. Whether it turned to hit, hit this unit here or attacked here, so... I think the French right can hold off the uh, British attempt to uh, try to get their cavalry around that that uh, that area of the battle. It's going to be interesting to see what the British can do because they have no they have no uh, reinforcements and. The French have, of course, the uh, third division of the fourth corps here under Lavelle, which can march up here and attack either here or over here where uh, Campbell's at, or march up to uh, assist either Lapise or Villette. And uh, Sebastiani is on the march to uh, take advantage of this exploitation that took uh, here with uh, the tour. He's going to follow up with his uh, 
first and second uh, divisions. The, the second division is pretty small under the lots. Lots. But that's the situation at the end of the nine o'clock hour and turning into the 10 o'clock hour. So just a lot of chaos out there as you would expect in a battle. So, really need need these to be different colors, kind of colors to match the the uh, cavalry, so that they're they're not don't appear to be like uh, disrupted or or uh, routed units. Same thing with the. Uh, Marcus for exhausted and tired, you know, be a different color. So, all right, so uh, come on back, see what happens uh, as we move to the Napoleonic Brigade system by MMP and the gamers. Uh, that'll be the next video.